Maximum armor. Stealth mode activated. Okay, seriously, the raptors are not gonna sit, smell this guy coming like a fucking mile away. Guys. You smell the open doors. Guys, you know how to open doors. See? There you go. Do the speed us. They're opening doors. Look away. Uh. Hey, Bob! You found anything? Nah, Steve, it's just that fucking door again. Should have stayed in bed. Seriously, I swear I heard something. X, B, X, B. Step over the stick. X, right. Oh, they did find him! The fuck are they bothering the other things then? What? What? What was that? What? Okay, never mind. Okay, if you guys found food already, why were you bothering with the humans? Sneaky time. What? What? Predators eat the food they kill. They don't bother going after other shit. Okay, let's go this way. Okay, seriously, I know I heard something this time. X. B. Damn it. Damn it. B. X. 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 B. Right? I'm trying to notice a pattern here. Okay, how many raptors are there? Did that one just come out the door to check on the other guy? Dad, are we going to stand here all day? You're right, hon. We should get moving. Uh, close the door. Reinforce it and let the others out. Locked. Smart. Not really. Okay, if you're just going to keep talking to yourself, why not tell them you're out there so they'll open the door? Oh, that's gonna help. Okay, so... Meanwhile... Eat her nose! Eat her nose! They're tasty! Aw, oh, damn it. I feel real. How am I not bad? I don't know. I'm not exactly happy about that fact. He left me alone. He owed us. Okay, saving game. Let's find out you're missing your bag. Where's the cane? Fiesta! No, no, no! Fiesta! And kind of this. That's mine. Ha! The high ground you is know, mine. This takes me back. I learned to shave with this stuff. Give it back now! I'm all out of shaving cream myself. You mind if I borrow some? Stop shaking it. But you're supposed to shake it before you use it. Says so. The can. You want to tell me what's so important about shaving cream, or do I ask InGen? <laughs> okay, uh, what do we do? It's not mine. Stuff it, fool. It's mine. Embryos, be careful. Make something up. It, it was my lover's. He died fighting for the revolution in Chile. It's all I have of his. Please give it back. Oh, that is so sweet. So, let me get this straight. Your Marxist revolutionary boyfriend made it a top priority to keep his face silky smooth. He must have been a very sensitive guy. <laughs> I ain't stupid, lady. You wanna try again? Embryos. They're dinosaur embryos. 
If you drop them, they'll be destroyed. Look, Yoder. Billy, right? Maybe we can make a deal. Ah, wink, this wink, nudge, nudge. Shoot. Ah, shoot. Threaten him, chivalry dead. I bet he's greedy. Threaten him. Threaten him sounds like a wonderful idea. Get back right now, or else. The big guy's in here. He's not so tough. Uh, better with me than against. Maybe you're in that tree for a reason. Your bodyguard isn't here right now, is he? Why don't you come down and we'll see who wants that can the most? Oh, that's cute. But kicking your butt won't do me any good if some damn dinosaur gets the drop on us. Point. You got so tough. Uh, better with me than against. Come on, think! Your chopper's gone, you're separated. Do you really want to spend all your time watching me? We could work together. I ain't scared of you. I know. <laughs> you make the point. Okay. Just the way she delivered that line. Oh man. Uh I bet he's greedy. There's a lot of money in it for you if I get those embryos to my contact before they go bad. Tell him the story, sell it. They're valuable. Maybe he's underpaid. Sell it, baby. You Work it. To you get a pat on the back. Maybe a little Christmas bonus. You leave it to me. You become a rich man. Pay off your debts. Quit your job. No more guys in suits telling you what to do. Just think about it. Come on, Billy. Money's good, and you won't have to worry about me causing problems. Everybody gets a little something. Okay, here's the deal. One, I'm in charge. I keep the embryos, and as soon as it's safe to break away, we'll deliver them to your contact. Okay. I don't know if the embryos will last in there much longer. That's a risk we're gonna take. Two, we're cutting Oscar in. Why? Because he's my partner, that's why. Yeah! It'll be fine. Trust me. Now sit tight and lighten up. Hatching a plan! enjoy the sunset on a tropical island with Billy Yoder. I love this guy. He reminds me of fucking Flynn Rider from Tangled. It's like, this has been an off day for me. Okay, so that's done. Meanwhile... So, any idea where we are in relation to the rest of the park? We're not far from the marine exhibit. I know for a fact that the phone there is in working order. Or at least it was this morning. Can we get there from the tunnels? I believe so. All right, By the then. way, what the Lead fuck the happened to your assistant? We'll get out of here as soon as possible. No more science projects, okay? I understand. Seriously. Uh, Laura, your radio show. Aren't you, uh... Laura? Who the fuck is Laura? So, Laura, I've been meaning to ask you. Oh, Dr. Why Sorkin. Why didn't you just fucking anymore? say Dr. Sorkin? Isn't that a radio show? Well, it wasn't really radio. I'd hack into the park intercom and play choice cuts from my record collection. Lately, I haven't had the time. Did you really have to show Artie Bridges how to do it? Believe me, I regret it. But how was I to know how bad he was? He begged me, said it was his dream to be in radio. <laughs> you know what, he should stick to managing the janitorial group. He is awful. He certainly is. Meanwhile, I guess Nom. there was a reason it was just a dream. He actually records his show ahead of time so that he can broadcast during work hours. Oh, hi, guys. Did you guys hear that? Sounded like a rat. Mm -hmm. hmm. Dinosaurs aren't the only invasive species InGen brought to the island. There are lots of rats in these tunnels. Maintenance is always setting traps down here. Raptors, don't step in the traps. You'll hurt your big toe. Uh, why aren't you chief? Are we going right away? These corridors all look the same. Don't worry, Jess. We should be safe in here. Where do all these doors lead? The maintenance corridors. The park's essential systems are in there. Uh, electrical, water, Slowing air conditioning. Slowing down on turns. The tunnels on this side are for transporting animals, personnel, and food. That's why they're so big. They are separate from the maintenance side to prevent accidents. So dinosaurs are running out of the maintenance area, and we're running out of the big, big areas where we have nowhere to hide. Awesome. Why aren't you, Chief? Are we going the right way? Are you sure we shouldn't head to the visitor center, Dr. Sorkin? InGen is bound to start there when they don't hear from the rescue team. 
These tunnels don't <laughs> suddenly became rather ashamed of that. Center. And I don't know about you, but I'd rather not risk any more overland travel. Uh, but I Besides. thought this part of the island was safe! Completely safe! Absolutely no predators on this side of the island whatsoever. Jagass. I wonder they left you behind. Well, as long as we're getting to know one another, how is it that Dr. Wu became chief geneticist over you? That's an easy one. Frogs. You're saying Damn it, the Kermit! Kept you from getting promoted? Specifically, their DNA. Before we could clone any dinosaurs, we had to decide how to fill in the gaps in the DNA sequences we found. I remember this from the tour. You found dino blood inside mosquito fossils, right? That's right. Well, they weren't really fossilized. It was amber. Prehistoric genome, cross-referencing all of the DNA found in the various amber samples. It would have been safer, but would have taken time the board of directors didn't want to spend. Well, even Dr. Hammond's spare-no-expense philosophy has limits, I guess. Exactly. Hmm. Henry, Dr. Wu, proposed using frog DNA to fill in the gaps. It was risky. We still don't know all of the effects. But it was a solution, and a fast one at that. So Henry became chief geneticist, and I took to the fields. Has anyone seen my cigarettes? I could swear I had some. Stop you smoking. Smoke. Normally, I manage to duck out a few times a day, but we've been preoccupied. Where did you last have them? Right here in my pocket, or so I thought. Maybe they fell out when we jumped from the water tower? Are we not seriously going to go back for the cigarettes? Oh, well. I'm probably better off without them. <laughs> Philosoraptor says don't smoke. Jess, don't be stupid. You little thief. Do you mind if we stop for a rest? My legs are killing me. I suppose we could all use a break. Did she seriously swipe those? I don't know how much longer those embryos will last. We need to meet my contact at the boat. We're staying here until Oscar gets back. We don't even know if he's alive. Oscar's fine. He's coming back. And come hell or high water, we are not leaving. I... Oh, fuck. I'm at a perfect height to be bitten. Then again, maybe you have a point. <laughs> run. No time. Hide. <laughs> a perfect bite level. Crap. Oh, fuck. I went the wrong damn way. Oh, well. Okay. Um. <laughs> Eat the duck! Don't move! It can't see you unless you move! It can hear you, dumbass. Oh, fuck. Off my face, you stupid. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. Boy! <laughs> Left bumper. Easy, girl. Fetch? What the fuck Damn did it. it? Why did it do that? Leaving now. The dinosaurs are playing frisbee. Shit is going bananas. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Seriously, why did it do that? 